Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to another um, video. Um, I have some yesterday uh, with Battlefield Vietnam and Battlefield 1942. The screen tear is very bad. So today, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix the screen tear for Battlefield Vietnam first, and then Battlefield um, 1942, right? Okay, so I hope that this video will help because playing that game and when you shoot the weapon, the screen just Tearing is very horrible and I found a way to fix it. I searched all over for a fix and I couldn't find a fix for this uh, game. So I finally found a fix today and I'm going to show you how to fix that to the right. So stay tuned guys and then we'll get back into the video alright. Alright guys, we're back in the game you know, in the game menu. And of course if you want to fix for the white screen the menu you can fix that sometime. But Today we're gonna fix the screen tear in the game, right? So, <coughs> sorry, I'll create a multiplayer match. Go to create game and uh, let me see. We'll select this uh, mission here, right? And I'm gonna show you all these screen tears. It's very horrible in this game. And I'm gonna show you how to fix that, right? Alright, guys, so we're starting the game here now. Ready, select the location, and once you get to the game, I'll show you all this screen tier. Right, it's very horrible and very unplayable, too. See the screen tier? Just when I shoot the weapon, you'll see the screen tier, and you see it's very horrible. As you can see, I'll show you all again. You see the screen is tearing. You see the screen is tearing, guys. When I shoot the weapon, everything is just moving and it's um like it's, it's it's moving like see screen tear. Look at the trees, screen tear. You will see. All right. If you want to fix this problem here, then. Let's get back on to the desktop and I'll show you how to fix the screen tear, right? Alright guys, to so fix the screen tear, well this is for AMD alone. I don't wait, this is for AMD, I don't know if you could do this on, on NVIDIA graphics. But if you're on AMD and you want to fix that screen tear, then open up the AMD software. Alright click here add game and find the game exe right find the game exe right this is it here click on it all right turn this on always on Radeon V-Sync reduces boot visual tear and lag. Okay. And okay. You could turn this on if you want. Uh yeah. Turn this on too. Reduces input lag. Alright. And, and this is it. If you want you could experiment the other stuff, the advance. Should I have this on? Alright, should I have this on? And uh, all right, you can experiment with these other things if you want. But the most important thing you need to do is enable this and enable this, right? So once you go back into the game, you will see the difference, and you will notice the screen turn again. So let's get back into the game. Oh yes guys, one more thing, launch the game from here, launch the game from here, right? So we have to click here and launch the game from here. So let's get back into the game. Game. Alright guys, here, 
and you wouldn't you will see that the anti lag has been the lag the screen turn has been fixed Let's go near to a tree and you will see that the lava fix. You see? You no longer see the screen tear again. You will still have the shaky shakiness, but alright. You see? The more screen tear. This has been fixed. Go near to a coconut tree. You no, see, you no longer see the screen tear. You see? So that means that the AC has been fixed. It will still be shaking a little bit, but you wouldn't see the screen tear as from before. It will lag a little bit because I'm recording. So as you see, the screen tear has been fixed. You no longer seeing the, the screen tear. So that's how you so that's how you fix the screen tier in this game. See? No more screen tier. As you see here. Screen tier is gone. And it no longer has the screen tier. So that is how you fix the screen tier in this game guys. So if you realize that the screen tier is horrible. And you want to fix it this is the way to fix it right so i hope that this video helps you could try this for nvidia graphics as well but uh this is the only fix that i, I found for amd graphics right so hope that this helps and i'll see you all in another video to come